press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Cattle fattening farming business is a very profitable business and many people are making money all over the world by doing cattle livestock farming business. You need a good cattle fattening business plan before you venture into this business. Cattle fattening farming is a lucrative business, but there are some essential things you need to do before you venture into the livestock farming business. You have to decide on the size of your livestock project i.e. the number of cattle you want to keep per cycle, location of the business for example a cattle farm, and your target market. These choices will be affected by the amount of capital you have, and the size of your target market. If you do not have a lot of capital, you can always start small, and grow your business over time. You need the cattle to feed in order to start cattle beef fattening business. You have to be careful when buying cattle to use for cattle pen fattening. If you make the wrong decision, you will be in a loss before you even start the cattle fattening business. When buying the cattle, you should be able to evaluate the potential for beef fattening of different types of cattle in relation to the market price of different grades of beef. Factors to consider include breed of cattle, gender, maturity type, and age. This is because different types of cattle respond differently to the beef fattening process. Money to buy cattle must be available at all times. A lack of funds to buy the cattle for beef fattening when prices are favorable is a lost opportunity to make a profit. Proper housing is important in successful cattle fattening operation. Adequately protect animals against the adverse effects of weather when they are raised in relatively small areas. The permanent type of housing, consisting of GI roofing, timber frames, concrete floor, feed trough, and water troughs are used in most farms. The shelter is open-sided and is located near the farmer's house or under the shade trees. Building height ranges from 1.7 to 1.9 meters while the width varies from 2.1 to 2.7 meters. Each animal can be allocated with 1.5 to 4.5 square meters. There are companies which sell cattle fattening stock feeds. These are complete, balanced feeds, which are designed for fattening cattle in feedlots over 90 days. The stock feeds are high energy fattening meals, which contain all the nutrients necessary for ad lib cattle pen fattening. You can also make your own homemade cattle beef fattening feeds. The amount of feed consumed by the cattle daily will depend on factors such as live weight and age of the cattle. Normally, it averages between 8 to 15 kilograms per head, per day or 3.4% of a steer's live mass, per day. The average daily weight gain at 350 kg live mass is about 1.6 kg. The number of farm workers you need will depend on the size of your cattle fattening farming project. If you are running a small business you and your family may be enough to take care of the cattle. However, if you are fattening many cattle for example 200 cattle, you will need full-time employees to manage the herd. There is need for good technical knowledge of cattle fattening techniques for success in the business and good management skills. The market for beef is very huge and is ever increasing. The annual global demand of beef is 58 million tons. That's a lot. You can supply your cattle or beef to individual households, butchers, auctions, farmers, schools, restaurants, companies, supermarkets, organizations, events, abattoirs etc. You can sell your cattle as live cattle or you can slaughter and sell the beef. The export market for beef is also very huge. As you grow your business you will be able to export the beef to other countries. The largest importers of beef are Russia, United States of America, Japan, China, South Korea, European Union, Hong Kong, Egypt, Canada, Chile, and Malaysia. If you have any question, you can comment below on this video. Finally a request, please don't forget to subscribe this channel, and stay with us.